The band will honor their late drummer with all-star rock shows in Los Angeles and London Foo Fighters will stage a pair of tribute concerts in honor of their late drummer, Taylor Hawkins. With the blessing of Hawkins' family, Foo Fighters will play shows at London's Wembley Stadium on September 3rd and Los Angeles Kia Forum on September 27th. These all-star rock shows will also feature as yet unannounced special guests, including musicians who were inspired by Hawkins. Tickets go on sale June 17th, and fans are encouraged to stay tuned to Foo Fighters' website for more details as they are confirmed. In a statement announcing the shows, Foo Fighters said, As one of the most respected and beloved figures in modern music, Taylor's monolithic talent and magnetic personality endeared him to millions of fans, peers, friends and fellow musical legends the world over. Millions mourned his untimely passing on March 25th with passionate and sincere tributes coming from fans as well as musicians Taylor idolized. The Taylor Hawkins tribute concerts will unite several of those artists. The Hawkins family and of course his Foo Fighters brothers in celebration of Taylor's memory and his legacy as a global rock icon, his bandmates and his inspirations playing the songs that he fell in love with, and the ones he brought to life. Additionally, Hawkins' wife, Allison has shared her first public statement since the passing of her husband. She expressed her gratitude to Foo Fighters fans for their outpouring of love, saying that their kindness has been an invaluable comfort for my family and me during this time of unimaginable grief. Hawkins also encouraged fans to celebrate his life and honor Taylor's legacy and the music he gave us. My deepest thanks admiration go out to the global Foo Fighters community and Taylor's fans far and wide for the outpouring of love each and every one of you have shown our beloved Taylor. Your kindness has been an invaluable comfort for my family and me during this time of unimaginable grief. As Taylor's wife, and on behalf of our children, I want to share how much you meant to him and how dedicated he was to knocking your socks off during every performance. Taylor was honored to be a part of the Foo Fighters and valued his dream role in the band every minute of his 25 years with them. We consider every band member and the extended Foo Fighters team our family. Taylor's endearing spirit and deep love of music will live on forever through the collaborations he so enjoyed having with other musicians and the catalog of songs he contributed to and created. In celebration of his life. It is now up to all of us who loved him most to honor Taylor's legacy and the music he gave us. Thank you all again for your love and sympathy. Taylor loved all of you and we love you too. Hawkins died suddenly on March 25 while Foo Fighters were on tour in South America. That night, the band had been set to perform at the Estereo Picnic Festival in Colombia. Hawkins had complained of chest pains, but when paramedics arrived to the band's hotel, they were unable to revive him and he was pronounced dead at the scene. While an official cause of death has yet to be revealed, preliminary toxicology reports found the presence of marijuana, antidepressants, benzodiazepines, and opioids in his system. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel.